planet from an evil darkness and lead seven pandas to reclaim the seven mystical beams of power. Join us as we discover that good and evil isn't always black and white. It must have been our lucky day because somehow my friends and I found an ancient kingdom underneath Bean Island. A kindly people were living there, but they were under a curse that King Audie put on them a long time ago. We offered to help them, but before we could, King Audie's creepy creation, Galoo, showed up and put all our plans on ice. We made a hasty exit. For some reason, Cool decided to stay behind and face Galoo by himself. He's definitely in for the fight of his life. You're so strong, but you're just a little panda. That surprise you? Don't underestimate me. I know more than you think. For instance, I know King Audi used his dark powers to create you out of clay. There's no way you could know that. That's true. But something inside me tells me everything now. I can feel it talking to me. Repeating. Just like an annoying commercial jingle. Ah, uh, yes. Of course. That's the desire bean. Call it whatever you like. I'm cool. You pandas call this entertainment? <laughs> what is it with all these reality shows anyway? Looks like a whole There's thing. nothing worse than a bunch of nosy pandas. And the one and the two, and now I put a spell on you. That's strange. The spell didn't work. Ah, uh, of course, I forgot. I gave the bean to Galoo. He must be using it. <laughs> I'm not so wicked, really. <laughs> I want to be happy, but it's King Adi who made me this way. I do as he says, or else I am finished. I promise you, spare me, and I will be your ace in the hole. Are you serious? <sighs> <laughs> I am number one. Stay away from King Adi or you'll pay big time. <laughs> the Desire Bean has hold of the panda. I must tell King Adi about this. I'm glad that's over with. I'm ready for the dry cycle now. I huh? lost a uh, contact lens. Oh no, wait. It's still in. I'd take that over my nostril full of water. Mm -hmm. Look, the water! If I ride that back down, I can help cool. Wait up, Toby! Love, stay back! I'll go get a rope. Max, don't let love jump in. <laughs> Hurry, Oscar. Mm. That Toby sure is a brave guy. He is. <laughs> ah! <gasps> cool! <sighs> Someone took your goggles. I'm not gonna fall for that. I apologize for my behavior, and I hope you feel better real soon. You know, Toby, sometimes you sound like a greeting card, and that really bugs me. Really? There's something happening to me that I don't understand. So that's why I want you and everyone else to keep their distance. I'm sick of you always trying to save me. Don't say that. I'll always help you whether you like it or not. You're wasting your time. There's only one thing I care about, and that's me, so you better stay out of my way. Because I would never do the same thing for you. Huh? Huh. Now beat it, Bumpkin! That a joke? What are you 
you doing here? I, I thought you guys already left. <gasps> I thought you were friends, not foes. <laughs> Don't cook! Trees are nice! <laughs> Look, Buster. I've been waiting so long to do that to you. You think you're so cool picking on an innocent tree. You may think you're all that, but you're not. So you think you're a tough guy? Well, come on, it's go time. Take that, take that, Chunk. Here's a cover cut. Double whammy. You want some more? Huh? Ugh. Who are you? I'm your worst nightmare, buddy. I'm me, the daughter of the Fairy King. You have heard of my dad, King Pano, haven't you? He won't stand for this, and neither will me. I. You might think fairies are all friendly I'm and nice, but we pack a mean wallop, so uh, watch yourself. Okay, are you feeling nauseous? I may not be as smart as you are, or as sharp a dresser, but you can count on me. Huh? You're my friend. I had to come back and help you. You do the same for me. All we have to do is work together. We can take this kingdom back. Right, the kid is syrupy, but he's got a point. Syrupy? But it feels so dorky. Being a dork can be fun. Even though you're kind of funny looking, I guess you really are my friend. Tell no one. <laughs> now we need to get to work. Ah, we've got to melt this ice. I'll get Dee Dee. Wait, me! Toby, you've huh? got to help Cruz right now! Mm -hmm. Hello! Have you been in a battle? Yes, a goggle panda did all this damage. What? The one called Cool is not like the others. The darkness is inside him. He tries to break free from the Desire Beat, but cannot. Here's an idea. Perhaps through him, we'll find the other beans of power. I've got it! He can find the beans of power! There! All this! Now, go! Hello. You good? I feel great! <laughs> huh? Hey, where am I? I bet King Adi gives us a race for sure. Yeah, he better. Not those two. Why those sneaks? And they've kidnapped Didi again. You see that? Huh? Is that a light bean or just some strange kind of insect? Look, there it goes! Quick, grab it! Do you think it wants us to follow it? Don't ask me. Jump for it. Oh! It was a trap! This always happens when I'm with you! Life is so unfair! Dee Dee! Dee Dee! Let's go, Dee Dee! Now, imagine that I just tickled your nose with a feather. That's it, Dee Dee! Keep blowing! Thank you, Dee Dee. I owe you one. We reptiles need to stick together. Now excuse me while I break the ice. Right! Rue style! <laughs> Whoa, I like chilling out, but not like that. You said it. You broke free! That's great! We couldn't have done it without the help of your friends here. You've traveled far and saved us. Mind you, things were pretty quiet around here before you arrived, but I'm not complaining. No offense to you, but please don't come back. <laughs> None taken, Cruz. See you later. <laughs> King Adi wants to see you. Come with me, cool. Get it? <laughs> Relax. I know you're gonna like working with us. We'll pick you out a nice outfit and everything. Cool! <laughs> You're in the way. You stay back or else. Numbskulls, let's go! Forget this noise! Ah. This guy's got attitude. Yeah, I'd say... Ah. Ah. I'm starting to lose my cool here. By the count of three, I want you out of here. Ah. 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 You're fighting a losing battle. One. 
Are you really gonna make me finish counting here? No. Cool's angry! He don't leave without us! Hey, Cool! Should I wait? I'm fine. I'm gonna teach this pterodactyl some manners! Hey, love, oh. look on the bright side. Oh, yeah, you can't look, can you? I'm fine. My contacts sting a little. And you would be down there swatting bottoms if you were okay? Uh-uh. There is always an alternative to inflicting pain on someone. Ah! <sighs> Next time we take a trip, you should bring along your eyeglasses. Oh? If there's one thing I've learned over the years as a sous chef, it's to always be prepared for anything. I baked souffles in hubcaps because I wasn't prepared. They tasted terrible and I only had myself to blame. <gasps> I had to make those mistakes so I wouldn't make them again. But the people I really feel bad for are the ones who ate the souffle and got terribly ill. That's gross. <sighs> Don't know what that has to do with your vision, but I'm sure you'll draw a connection. Thanks, Max. I think I see your point, sort of. Please never make me a souffle. Libby, I've got great news. He's here. Cruz is all right. Libby! Cruz, is that really you? Can it be? It's only been a hundred years. What took you so long? I got lost, sweetie. This place is like a maze. And look at me, I'm a snake. Excuses, excuses. Oh, great. Here comes the waterworks. Huh? She's losing leaves? Are you cold, sweet tree? Libby! That'll work. My bark's a little crispy, but I do feel better. Oh, Cruz, I don't know how much longer I can last in this form. How can we break the curse, Cruz? That evil king cut off one of my horns and hid it somewhere in the caverns below the palace. If I can find the horn, I can remove the curse that Libby and I are under. My horn was probably swept away long ago and is rotting somewhere in the depths of this place. Wait! Toby, you have the horn! Uh, huh? I do? Is this it? My horn! Now I can break the curse! Wowee! Hey, I like your hat! I don't normally dress like this. I was at a wedding. I kind of like how you're dressed. Oh. Libby? There's something I've been meaning to ask you. <gasps> Libby! Oh, Cruz! Oh. <laughs> My arms, they feel so wooden. I'm just happy to have some arms, period. So, will you? Yes! How sweet! We did it, Dee Dee! Oh, cool! You made it! Look! The water! The ice has started melting! Everything's returning to the way it used to be! Let's go! Mm. <gasps> <laughs> hey, you two! Wait for us! Three cheers for the bride and groom! Toby! Follow us! Okay! Come the bride and groom! Congratulations! Welcome, Welcome back. back! We'll take you to the surface, but it will be faster if you ride on our backs. <laughs> you heroes saved our kingdom. We will never forget what you've done for us. Thank you. I can feel my arms again. Hmm. This wedding makeover isn't finished yet. Oh, look at that. This is too much. I don't care if I do have allergies. Those flowers are beautiful. This good smelling stuff is for you. Please, I want you to have it. This place could use some redecorating. Yes. Hey, Cruz. Look! Hey, that's Oscar's camera! Yes, it was found near the lake. 
Hey, Toby, quit breaking the lens with your face. Okay. That was close. I don't know about you, but I'm thinking about finding a new line of work. I'm hungry. He wouldn't believe the adventure we had. Cool's here, too. Hi, Cool. Oh, I'm so sorry. I couldn't help you down there. Hey, it's all good. Toby helped me. Toby helped you? You let someone help you? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's not get all crazy with this. Cool? Love. <laughs> Welcome to our world. Oh. <laughs> Hello. It's me, Cruz, and this is Libby. The curse is broken? It's a pleasure to know good pandas like you. Come back and visit our kingdom anytime. We'll throw a party in your honor. Goodbye. Bye now. See you soon. Huh. Look out, Philo! <laughs> Goodbye, <laughs> take care. Does it still work? Here. Hmm. Who are those strange characters, Toby? They're our new friends. Who are they? I'll need another angle on this story. Huh? Yeah. Not until we get something to eat first. <laughs> oh, another souffle slice? I wouldn't, but if you insist... <laughs> Scope of the century. And I miss it. This bean, what is it? Huh? Ah! I don't understand. What's happening? I feel evil inside my mind. Ah! Action light. Oh, Daddy Love. We're on our way back to the station right now. Why? I see. No problem. I'll tell him. Poor guy. Hey, wake up! We're home now! Huh? Okay! <sighs> cool. Wait. I have to tell you something. You've been promoted to accounting. Promoted? Daddy Love just called. He says he wants to put you behind a desk. A desk? Now listen. Why don't you try it out? You're gonna get yourself a nice race. Hey, wait, cool! What happened, Oscar? Huh? A race! Hello. Hey, look out! Desk. A tie. What's wrong with you, cool guy? Do you mind? I'm thinking about my future here. You get shoved into accounting when you just want to be a reporter, win big awards, and take over as the station president. Is that so wrong? Not really. But futures can change if you like. Huh? The darkness that lives inside you wants to come out, help you change your future, show you how to be the president of evil. Ah! Hail to the chief. Hey, I've got plans. Let Ooh! me go. Oh, hey. Not oh, rude. That's not nice. Apparently, there are plans for me. Huh? Big plans, and they don't include you. You got that, bumpkin? Hey, Toby, I'm kind of busy. Cool! What are you doing? Going for a dip. But it's cool, though!
next time I see you, my hometown gets turned to stone. Cool's missing, and now no one will play charades with me. Oh, and I meet up with the evil King Kulu, whoever that is. And it all happens next time on Pandalian.